Welcome to USMLEFastTrack.com. The section we're going to talk about today is from First Aid for the USMLE Step 1, 2013 Edition. Page 224. Common Metastasis. What does cancer metastasis indicate? Cancer metastasis generally indicates an advanced sign of cancer, and usually cancer at this point is at a higher stage and has poor prognosis. Where do tumors in the brain commonly metastasize from? Order them from the most common to the least common. The most common area where the brain tumors metastasize from is lung followed by the breast, then the genital urinary tract, osteosarcoma, melanoma, and finally the GI tract. So basically the primary tumor is located on these sites and then eventually will metastasize to the brain. What percentage of brain tumors are from metastasis? 50% of brain tumors are from metastasis. Describe the characteristic of the brain metastasis. Brain metastasis are typically multiple and well circumscribed tumors at the gray-white matter junction. Where do liver tumors commonly metastasize from? From the most common to the least common. Liver tumors commonly metastasize from the colon, followed by the stomach, and then finally pancreas. What are two of the most common sites of metastasis after regional lymph nodes? The two most common sites of metastasis after regional lymph nodes are the liver and lungs. Where do bone tumors commonly metastasize from, from the most common to the least common? Bone tumors commonly metastasize from prostate or breast, followed by the lung, and then finally thyroid or testes. Are primary bone tumors more common or bone metastasis more common? Bone metastasis are much more common than primary bone tumors. What areas of the skeleton would bone metastasis commonly affect? Bone metastasis commonly affects the axial skeleton, such as the skull, spine, spinal cord, sternum, and ribs. So you should be able to see this in the whole body bone scan. What type of bone lesion would you typically see if the metastasis is from the lung? If the metastasis is from the lung, you would see lytic bone lesions. Describe the lytic bone lesions. Lytic bone lesions are destruction of bone and this leads to resorption and therefore you would have an increase in the level of calcium in the blood. What type of bone lesion would you see if the metastasis is from prostate? If the bone metastasis is from prostate, you would see blastic lesions. Describe blastic lesions. Blastic lesions will cause production of more bone to form and therefore will increase bone density. What types of lesions would you see if the metastasis to the bone is from breast? If the metastasis is from the breast, you would see both lytic and blastic lesions. For more information on this topic, click on the link in the description section below. For a full USMLE Step 1 review, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com where we help you review the entire first aid for the USMLE Step 1 with high quality videos and hundreds of detailed pictures for a better understanding of the material. So to learn from the best USMLE review book, be sure to check us out at usmlefasttrack.com.